If you're looking to travel on a budget, keep these eight locales on your hit list. Number 8. Cuba. Cuba has long been a fairly inexpensive vacation spot for Canadians and Americans willing to risk not being able to get back into their country. Although U.S. relations with Cuba have been improving, travel restrictions for tourism are still in place. For Canadians and others, Cuba remains an inexpensive Caribbean option. Havana is the place to go for the most culture, although other popular spots include Montezillo de Cuba and Varadero. Round-trip flights can be as low as $400 CAD, and hotels start at $66 CAD per night. If you're looking for an all-inclusive option, things get even more affordable, a seven-night package deal, including all taxes and fees, starts around $500 CAD for two people. As of September 2015, Americans are allowed to travel to Cuba for purposes such as education or humanitarian projects, such as offering assistance to the Cuban people. Number 7. Panama. Here's a destination not many people would consider when they think about flying south for the winter, Panama. This Central American country doesn't get a lot of love from sun seekers. Nonetheless, Panama City is a prime destination. The flight will set you back around $700 due to the lesser demand and more infrequent flights, but accommodations will run you around $40 USD a night for a three-star hotel. Package deals are also available usually running around the $1,300 mark a little higher than some would like to pay, but worth it to get to a destination that's off the beaten path for most snowbirds. Unlike high traffic destinations like Punta Cana and Cancun, Panama City is still economical and less likely to be overrun with spring breakers, making for a relaxing vacation whether you go all-inclusive or not. Number 6. Florida. Your Florida vacation can either be really expensive or really cheap. While people flock to Orlando and Miami, there are plenty of places that offer all the sun and sand with a lower price tag. You can fly to Tampa for the same price as Miami, but you can pick up three-star accommodations for $85 per night in Tampa. Compare Miami at $115 per night. If you insist on Miami or Orlando, a flight will set you back around $260, and a hotel in Orlando can cost as little as $45 USD per night. If you're visiting either of these popular locations, definitely check into package deal options offered by travel agencies and vacation companies to see if you can get even better pricing. Other options for those looking to get off the beaten path could include West Palm Beach and Daytona Beach. Number 5. Bahamas. At first glance, the Bahamas might seem overpriced to a lot of North Americans. First, they're relatively close to Florida, but flight prices seem to jump, and hotels start around $100. Package deals, in theory, should make a trip to the Bahamas a little more affordable, but the truth is that you're better to book Bahamas yourself. Flights can be as little as $400 or $500 CAD and even with the cost of accommodations for, for 7 days that's still cheaper than some of the packages out there. Selecting your own destination in the Bahamas also allows you to best pick the venues suited to your itinerary. While Freeport is an option, it is more expensive than the bigger port of Nassau. This is one destination where looking for last-minute deals and seat sales will save you more cash. Number 4. Jamaica. How much you pay to escape to Jamaica really depends on where and how you go. For some destinations, package deals are your best bet, 
All-inclusive vacations for Ocho's Rio start around $900 CAD with all the taxes and fees in. Montego Bay, on the other hand, is better for travelers looking to build their own itineraries, a flight will set you back around $500, but accommodations can be as low as $30 or $40 USD a night. Runaway Bay is another do-it-yourself option, you'll still need to fly into Montego Bay and accommodations are better booked on your own a package deal in this area will actually cost you more. Kingston, the country's capital, is more expensive to fly into, as its airport is smaller than the one at Montego Bay. Number 3. Arizona If you're looking to escape the cold, why not consider Arizona? Located in the middle of a desert, Arizona is actually more pleasant during the winter months and you can score a round-trip flight to Phoenix for about $400. At the lower end of things, accommodation hovers around the $50 per night mark. While not exactly a high-profile destination, Arizona has been gaining popularity with the snowbird crowd who are looking for alternatives to Florida at a lower price point than California. Phoenix in particular has a lot of attractions including a number of golf courses. If you want to hit the greens, definitely consider Arizona as your winter escape. While you may not be able to pick up package deals for Arizona like you can for some sun destinations, definitely keep your eyes peeled for deals seat sales can save you a pretty penny on airfare. Number 2. Mexico Mexico has long been known as a haven for snowbirds looking to escape the chill of winter without feeling the pinch of their pocketbooks. While destinations like Acapulco and Cancun are on the lists of every spring breaker, try nabbing up a cheap destination vacation to one of Mexico's many other charming areas, like Puerto Vallarta where a flight will cost you about $500 but a hotel will set you back just $45 a night, or you can package it up for about $800. Ixtapa and Manzanillo are popular destinations as well, and both come with a similar price tag. Other, less frequented Mexican destinations can cost a bit more since there's less demand for flights but hotel prices remain low throughout the country. Last-minute deals and seat sales can be your best friends to get to these less frequented locales. Number 1. Dominican Republic The Dominican Republic has earned a reputation among snowbirds and travelers as a relatively cheap destination to soak up some sun. Popular with spring breakers, the Dominican Republic has a few popular destinations like Punta Cana and Puerto Plata. Flights will run you around $500 to either destination, but three-star hotels are available for about $75 a night. Like other destination vacations in the Caribbean, you can look for a package deal to maximize your savings. Roll your flight and hotel together into a seven-night all-inclusive excursion for about $900. Other popular destinations on the island include Santo Domingo, which is a better book-it-yourself option, the flight is slightly more expensive than other areas on the island, but accommodations will set you back just $35 a night. Now news.